guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to do a little bit of a face-off between Tanya Burr and Fleur de Force makeup. I'm also going to use Mislin makeup in this video because it is a full face makeover. So I want to use makeup um, that I don't have in the Tanya and Fleur range and use something different. So I'm going to use Mislin. So yeah, let's get into the video. Okay, so firstly, I'm gonna start off with the eyes. Now the palettes themselves do look very similar. So as you can see, the colors are almost identical. Now admittedly, just by looking at the palettes, Fleur's does look a little bit more pigmented than Tanya's, but it's not about the looks, it's about the application. But I'm gonna use my Mislin palette um, just as the base and transitional colors. So I'm gonna use Dance Fever as the transitional color and uh, Sport Fever as the base. Now these two colors are so pretty, just look at them. You've got this kind of purpley and a gray kind of khaki color. It's just so beautiful. Okay, so let's start with the base. Oh my goodness, just look how pigmented this Mistlin eyeshadow is. Wow, incredible. You really don't need a lot on your brush at all. Okay, so these two colors were absolutely beautiful. The pigmentation was just out of this world. Oh my goodness, just look at that. Now I'm gonna use Tanya's makeup on this side and I'm gonna use Fleur's on this side. So first things first, I'm gonna go in with the browns. So with Tanya's palette, I'm gonna use this brown just here. Like I said in my testing Tanya Burr makeup, it's a very natural brown color, so it's not overly pigmented, but it's so beautiful. I do like this color a lot. So with the Mislin eyeshadow on the base, the Tanya eyeshadow is going on really well. It's kind of given like a beautiful shimmery look, which I'm really liking right now. So I'm just gonna use Witch's Cat along the lash line. Oh, this is quite pigmented, this one. Now I'm just gonna grab my Mislin palette again and just highlight the corners. Now I really do love the pigmentation in this palette. Okay, so moving on to the Fleur de Force palette, I'm gonna use this color just here, just because I think it's very similar to that one just there. So, ooh, let's see what this one's like. Ooh, okay, wow. Wow, 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 wow. I don't know if you can see already, but that is much more pigmented than the Tanya Burr one. It's a lot darker, but it's going on beautifully. So I'm gonna use Run Fever in my Mislin palette just because there wasn't a similar color to Witch's Cat in the Fleur de Force palette, and this one will look beautiful. And again, I'm gonna use my Mislin palette to apply Sport Fever just to highlight a bit. So the Fleur de Force palette was a little bit dusty, but I think comparing the two, they are so similar. Admittedly, when I applied the Fleur one, it did look a little bit more um, pigmented, but once I blended everything out, it looked very similar to the Tanya Burr one. Now, the Tanya Burr one is a little bit more shimmery, whereas the Fleur one was a bit more matte, um, but yeah, they both work and they look beautiful against the Mistlin color as well. I'm really impressed. So I'm just gonna pop on a little bit of mascara using the Mislin Volume Mascara. Now just look at this, guys. That looks amazing. Now I just quickly want to show you what this look would look like with a nude lipstick. Now I'm gonna use this Mislin True Identity Lipstick, which is a cream to matte lipstick. Wow, I thought that this was nude, but just check out that color. Oh my goodness. Wow, I absolutely love it. It looks gorgeous against the eyes. Amazing. Okay, so now to continue with the Tanya versus Fleur Off. That sounds quite cool, Fleur Off. <laughs> so as you can see, these two colors are very similar. They're not quite the same, but they're similar. So I'm gonna first pop on Tanya Burt using only half my lips. This is gonna be interesting. Okay, so I have no idea which one I prefer. Now the Tanya one did dry a lot quicker than the Fleur, but they're kind of two different reds, so you've got more of an orangey red and you've got more of a rich red. Oh my goodness, I think they both tie on this one. Comment below, which one do you like? Tanya, Fleur. Tanya or Fleur? There we go guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. Please click on my little floating head to subscribe to this channel because I'll be doing so many more of these videos, so please hit that little button. I've also included a few of my favorite videos for you to check out. 
Be sure to follow me on all my social media sites. All links to those are down below. But as always, guys, please make sure that you link, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time for another video. Goodbye.